Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for September 16th of 2025 is titled New Comet Swan 25b over Mexico. So, what do we see here? Well, in the sky we see a comet, and we can see the head of the comet down toward the lower right, and that is the greenish glow there of the coma of the comet around the nucleus. The nucleus itself, or the actual comet, is completely invisible. It's far too small for us to be able to see from Earth. And then stretching back up toward the upper left is the tail of the comet, and the tail will always point opposite to the direction of the sun in the sky. And that's because the material in the tail is being pushed back by the sun. So it'll always tell you the direction of the sun in this image, which would be down below the horizon to the lower right-hand side. Now, this comet, known as C-2025R2 Swan, or known as Swan 25b, is a relatively newly discovered comet and is visible with binoculars right now, if you know where to look. And it's just coming away from the sun, so it's going to be getting more and more prominent over the coming weeks. Now, comets are not easy to predict in terms of brightness because there are so many variables within the detailed structure of the nucleus itself, how much material it has and how much of that is available to be expelled because really it is the coma around the comet and then the tail pushing back that are what make the comet prominent in the sky. The comet can come and go, and just the nucleus, and we're never going to even notice it, even at a close distance from Earth. Now, this one isn't going to get close to Earth. It'll get, at best, about a quarter the distance between Earth and Sun. So, that's not incredibly close. We're not in danger of a collision or anything with it. But, we will have a chance, perhaps, over the next few weeks to a month, to be able to see the comet as it brightens. Now, how much? That's a good question. And will it be bright enough to see without a device? And we do not know for sure. Really, we're just going to have to watch it over the next few weeks and see how it exactly brightens. It's quite possible that it would be visible with a phone pictures, which you can get before you even see it with your eyes. If you know the right direction and snap the photo, you can actually see it in the images, and that's because it'll take a slightly longer exposure and bring up fainter details than you would see with your eye. So we will be looking at that over these next few weeks, and hopefully if it does brighten, it will be a chance to see another comet currently visible in the southern sky and slowly moving northward. So for those north, we'll have a better chance to be able to see it over the coming weeks as it brightens. So that was our picture of the day for September 16th of 2025. It was titled New Comet Swan 25B over Mexico. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone and I will see you in class.